Oh god, P please no. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome to Fine Nights at Chuck E. Cheese's Reboot. That's right, one of the hardest Fine Nights at Freddy's fan games of like 2015, 2016, I think it was 2015, is getting a reboot. Now it's made by Radiance, which is the team that I believe are going to remake different FNAF fan games, and the fact that they decided to remake this one makes me just a tad bit worried, because their games are definitely kind of creepy. So to see this one getting remade kind of scares me a bit. But I'm excited nonetheless just to see if this one is... Oh, hey Fred, I need someone to take my night shifts this week because I because of family some family issues. Would you be up for the task? Give me a call if you're interested. Thanks, Sue. Okay, well, Fred is taking up Sue's night shift. I would have posted this yesterday, but my cat, um, we had to bury her. Abby? Yeah, she's gone now. We don't, we're not sure what killed her, but she's dead. Maybe after I get back from vacation, I'm gonna, like post a video of it oh sweet hello hey fred hey fred oh i'm fred he's here working overtime look at you you get to make some extra cash anyway management is requiring me to leave you messages every night to help you out with your shifts Ow. We normally don't have anyone looking over this place during the night, but since we're shut down for innovation, there's been some concern. Breaking hmm. and vandalism and that kind of thing. Okay. So we needed someone, you in this case, to look over the place and make sure everything, especially Chucky and his friends, okay. is in check. Alright. Uh, first things first. I'm assuming management left you with the camera system. If you turn the monitor on, be able to flip through the channels for the cameras that are placed throughout the building. It's not much, but it's at least something to look at while you're bored. And to watch for anything out of the ordinary, of course. Oh. They aren't top notch, so don't be surprised if things are a little finicky. <clears throat> also, behind you should be a security gate. Now, there were some issues in the past that basically forced us to put in that gate. It's a little broken, however. Instead of you just turning the handle and then keeping itself shut, you have to keep it closed by holding down the handle. Hmm. I know it's a bit annoying, but in not gonna touch emergency, it. you're gonna need that gate. Just don't play okay. around with it too much. You don't want it jamming on you. Alright, uh I think this should be it. Oh wait, yeah. Um I I know this wasn't really in the job description. Oh boy. But whenever you get the chance. Please head down to storage and pick up some things that need to be restocked. Oh! Management should have put a list down there. I'm sure you'll see it. Should be quick and easy to do at the end of your shift. And don't worry, it'll probably be counted in your paycheck. Okay. Alright, that should be everything for now. I'll talk to you tomorrow, and uh, have a good night. Okay, so this is how I close it. I don't... Alright, so, okay. Right here, I'm pretty sure they're gonna go through the camera system, but basically, this is the portrait style stage. So this is how Chuck E. Cheese started out, and it wasn't even Chuck E. Cheese at the beginning. It was Chuck E. Cheese Pizza Time. Theaters, theaters, theaters. Nothing there. Oh God, there he is. Hey, buddy. Oh yeah, it's and also this takes place in 1979, so this is two years after Chuck E. Cheese originally opened. Oh boy. Oh. Nothing there, I don't see him. Where'd he go? Stop scaring me. I'm very easily frightened.
Oh, there he is. Okay. Scared me for a second there, buddy. Oh, he doesn't have legs. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because obviously it's the portrait style stage. So, to save money... They... Oh, God. Wow, that worked. Is there any indicator? Okay, there he is. Is there going to be any indicator that he's going to be at the door? So, he goes from here, and then he goes to Camp 4. Oh, no, Camp 5. You said there? Yeah, you are. Look at you. Oh, shoot. Nope, nothing there. Oh, oh. Huh. Well, that's not creepy. So, is it just Chuck? I think it's just Chuck. So, originally, Chuck E. Cheese was portrait style stage rather than how they are now. I mean, obviously, I'm pretty sure some of you who watch this video, or hopefully watch this video, have seen Chuck E. Cheese and know how the stages work. Oh, there he is. Okay. That's. That's. That's not creepy at all. And there's no power either. Yeah, I don't think there's a power. Oh, that's not creepy at all. Okay, he's gone. You back there? There you are. So you you don't go back to the portrait stage, you just stay... <laughs> thank you, thank you. Okay. Now about that task, what do I do? Collect all the items off the list. Red watch. White watch. Oh, yellow button. Oh, don't collect that. Oh, green watch? White computer. Whoa! Who is that? That was a T- Oh, that was a TV! Okay. Oh, stage call? Oh, wait, I know who that was. That was Krusty the Cat from... Hey again, Fred. Hey. I see your first night went well. Yep. If it didn't, you obviously wouldn't be here right now. <laughs> I, I mean, you know, you wouldn't quit or like that. Uh, so as you probably already know, the ship is a piece of cake. And hopefully nothing is causing you trouble. Keep an eye on the gate, keep an eye on the cameras. Oh, yeah, the cameras. Uh, before we shut down, we're having some infestation issue. Oh, I think there's still a rat or something running around the building. Oh! Employees have complained about things being knocked over and stuff just being out of place. Hmm. So we have reason to believe it might be staying in that back room. That back room hasn't been cleaned up for quite a while. Oh, God. Uh, so, yeah, just keep an eye over there and make sure nothing bad happens. Also, uh, so the technician yesterday reported a problem with the animatronic. So don't worry. Hi there. Yeah. There's just been a problem where they'll try to perform when they shouldn't. I think they should have noted Jasper and so in case there's ever an issue where they start moving around or they're maybe out of place, uh, we've given you something on the desk that we like to call the stage call. So 
basically what this does Ooh. is it resets any oh. character and makes them go back to their idle state. Uh, hopefully you never have to use it. But, uh, yeah. That should be all. Just keep an eye on those cameras. Okay, whenever you need them. Oh, well, and again, make sure to restock items again after the shift. Alright. Good night. Okay, so there's a costume and Jasper. Jasper. Hmm. Okay, wait. So when Mick, not Mick, Mickey, Mickey, really? Okay, he's gone. Oh, you've got to be kidding me! Now Jasper's gone. Oh, but you're there. What else do I use it? Quiet on the set. Quiet on the. Huh. So the costume is alive? Huh, interesting. is going on in the background well it's gone now so <laughs> Whoa, Jasper try again why and and oh 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 wait hold on a second so oh my god that made my hands sweat so does this stage call... I'm gonna do that because I don't feel like... Okay, so the stage call... Does it call Jasper back? Because Jasper and Mick were... Chuck were both there, I think. Because I knew, I knew Mick was there behind the gate. But... Ch but... Oh my god. I knew Chuck was there behind the gate. But when Jasper appears, I gotta use the stage call... Oh, okay. Um, I think I better stop because that kind of freaked me out. I might, I might actually check out some gameplays of this game. You know, FNAF horror games. I don't really feel like playing sometimes. I like them. And it's just a way to get some videos out. Excuse me, I burped. I had some water, and it's a way to get videos out. And I don't really prefer prefer to play them unless one's been keeping an, my eye on it. And this one has had my eye. I have had my eye on Five Nights at Chuck E. Cheese's. I didn't want to play the original. I was waiting for something like this, actually. I didn't think it was going to happen, though. But something tells me that Radiance, the team right down here, are actually going to start making more FNAF remakes. Which is awesome, because I really would like to see more FNAF remakes. So keep it up, Radiance, and I'll definitely check out some other games. But I need to check out some gameplays of this. But that freaked me out. Okay. Bye.